Hello, everybody. Sorry, I'm a few minutes late just getting organized here. I am so happy to have you guys all here again today. Thank you again for taking the time out of your day, out of your schedule to have a listen and to be here. So thank you. Thank you for showing up for yourself that your time and your purpose matter. And today is going to be a little bit more short and sweet, but I am honored that you guys are here and showing up. So thank you. Let's just jump right into today's Living Your Life on Purpose webinar. Did you all take action on yesterday's homework? Why? What is your why? Question number one. And number two, I asked of you on a scale of zero to 100, what percentage are you committing to yourself to take action on your dream? If you don't know your why, you'll never start. Or perhaps you do, but you don't follow through. Have you ever had this happen to you before? You've started different things that thought, you know, like, okay, this would be the thing. This, this is it. I feel the passion here. And yet you allow external noise or external self-sabotaging thoughts to just put the stop button on it. I had this thought yesterday and um, not about this thing, just about past things and why I know I am so driven to do this thing right now. And I am living my on purpose, living into this coaching. And so that's why I ask you to sit on your why. This is why I asked you to sit and process these thoughts because there are so many things that go into it. Why is it important? What is your motivation? What is your goal? You need to know a why. I am a 40-year-old mom to three who has been married to my husband for 18 years and together for 24. Why do I want more? Why should I want more? Why do I even think I deserve more? You know why? Because all of these things don't define me. These are all a part of me. But they do not mean that because I have achieved X, Y, and Z, that my dream ends. That I am living a life that I once dreamed of. Yes, that is true. I always dreamt of being married and having kids. And I am living that. But what else do I dream of? What else am I committed to going after? Just because I have achieved and have some amazing things in my life and have achieved personal goals, this does not mean that I need to stop and stop and like just status quo for the rest of my life. Again, I'm 40. Keep dreaming. Keep growing. You deserve whatever is on your mind and in your heart. If you don't choose your path, someone else will. Someone else will choose it for you. Someone else will dictate what time you have and what you need to do with it. So choose it for you. I was trying to look for this quote. And of course, when I need it, I can't find it. But there's this quote that's like, Sam Walton was 44 when he started Walmart. So-and-so was X age when they started this. And it's just so powerful because you don't have to give up on your goals at a certain age or a certain stage in life. There are so many examples of that, and I'm sure you have examples of that in your own life and are with the people in your life and that surround you daily. We all start goals and dreams in a place of desire, drive, and internal wise. So then if we have all this and these feelings, what makes us take the leap, take the chance, and then continue to work on ourselves day after day? The dedication to ourselves the desire to be the best. The best is very different to us all, but commitment to achieve comes from a desire to do better, to be better, and inevitably be our best self. So today, walking through your goals from yesterday, I hope that you see how breaking them down into achievable, tangible action steps where you can actually see and feel wins along the way, how that will hold you at a level of consistency and accountability. We have these huge dreams, but 
It's just that it's a dream until we start to activate it and take action on it. And to be able to do that, we need to identify the path to get there. It doesn't happen overnight. It doesn't happen sometimes in a month, in a year, in five years, in 10 years, but it's taking action on things now, on things today. So this is where I come in. Working me, with me, we get so personal and exact on these feelings and the outcomes that with my unwavering support, you will take action on your goals. You will see results in your dreams. Thank you so much for dedicating the time to watch and listen and hopefully learn and question what is within your desires and what is in within your reach and your dreams. I am here and look forward to working with you on your accountability and your growth. So with that being said, I'm always here for questions and answers, and I will have more of those upcoming. Um, I have a small, uh, two small groups coming out, small group coaching and one-on-one -on -one coaching, and limited availability in both. In order to secure a place, I will offer you a free clarity call at the end of this call that will be live through till September 4th for you to book in with me. And we'll also give you $200 off either one of these packages that you choose to um, take action on. So again, one small um, group mastermind coaching, three month commitment starting September the 12th. And then I have a few spots left in my one-on-one -on -one coaching also starting for September. So I really hope that we can together walk through your dreams, make tangible actions. And I am here on your side to hold you accountable and to keep living your life on purpose. So have a fabulous day, have a fantastic rest of your week. And if you are interested in learning more or taking advantage of the free clarity call that I always offer, um, then please reach out to me prior to September 4th. We can book you something in uh, so that we can start to achieve all of the goals and all of your dreams along the way. So happy, happy day, everyone. Thank you again so much for taking the time for me and um, see you soon.